Assalamualaikum to our beloved lecturer, Dr. Sri Ayu Masuri. Today, our team members, on behalf of the Internet Operation Department, will be presenting about some issues, strengths, weaknesses, and also some recommendation for Brotherhood and Co. Hello, my name is Akram Hamim. I will be presenting about the issues that arise in the Brotherhood and Co. for the Internet Operation Department. So, for the first issue is about the staff problems. As we all know, during the COVID-19, people cannot go out frequently. So the amount of the customer for the Bradu and Co are reducing day by day. This will affect the profit of the Bradu and Co to decrease. So they do not have enough money to pay salary for their staff. Moving on to the next point, there are some staff that did not follow order or instruction from their leader. This bad behavior will affect the working environment of the cafe. Next, there are also some staff that ask for a leave during the peak period. Logically, during peak period, uh, a cafe or a restaurant uh, need more staff than usual in order to handle their customer. But for the Bradu and Co, they are lack of the staff, so their customer satisfaction are decreasing. Next, there are also lack of knowledge to handle food panda. As we all know, many restaurants and cafe nowadays are using food panda services as a medium for their delivering of their product or food. So for the Brotherhood and Co, since there are lack of knowledge, they cannot fully maximize their production to their customer. Moving on to the next issue uh, that arises in Bradu and Co, which is about the customer complaint. Recently, Bradu and Co had received customers complaint from the resident in the Shah Alam. The resident spread rumors in their Facebook groups by claiming that this cafe has a bad service. They recommend to not go to this cafe. This complaint will give bad image and also bad reputation for the Bradu and Co. Um, last issue is about the limited service provided. Bradu and Co cannot handle catering service when there is any demand from the customer because of limitation of time. The business do not have enough staff to execute the catering service. It's Muhammad Akhid Hanafi and I will be presenting about the strength for Brotherhood and Co. The first, the first strength is the friendly working environment. For example, if the employee receive complaint from customer for their below pass service, the manager does not hastily take action and instead first investigate the problem. If the employee is in the wrong, he will motivate and give solution on how to become a better worker. This is important because a friendly working environment will lead to a higher job satisfaction and increased productivity while an offensive or unfriendly working environment will lead to boredom, less productivity, and dissatisfaction. The second strength is excellent quality control. Quality control is essential to building a successful business that delivers products that meet or exceed customers' expectation. For example, before sending out food to the customers, the manager always makes sure to check the food first. The third strength is they have the lower price for Western food compared to other competitors. In Section 7 Sha'alam, Brotherhood & Co. has the lowest price for their Western food compared to other competitors. Uh, lower price are, relati are relatively easy to attract new customers. Their fourth strength is they maintain good relationship with their customers. Powerful customer relationships are essential to business success. Just like personal relationship, it is important to cultivate and nurture customers' relationship. When organization or in this case the restaurant develops strong relationship with their customers, it can lead to loyal client, positive word of mouth, and increased sale. Uh, in Brotherhood and Co case, they have good relationship with their customers and so they can ask directly what their weaknesses is and they can amend and solve the problem in the future. The last strength is they have various supplier. 
Brotherhood and Co. does not rely on one main supplier. Instead, they have various supplier. For example, uh, if their main supplier, which is Pasar Besar Meru Kelang, is unable to provide them, they can rotate and rely on another supplier. This way, they can operate without having problem with their stock. Assalamualaikum to our lecturer and to all the Peru classmates. My name is Muhammad Firdaus bin Kamaru Zaman and I'm going to continue to present on the weakness of the internal operations of the uh, Brotherhood & Co. In this business, we found that there are a few weaknesses that the business have which might affect them uh, in the long term run. Thus, uh, we think that the business should be concerned about uh, their weaknesses in order for them to improve in the future and uh, to promote the sustainability uh, of the cafe. Firstly, we found that the business is unable to manage the customers well. When the cafe is full with dine-in customers and at the same time, the customers uh, who made their order through Foodpanda. According to the owner, it is difficult as they are unable to manage which order is more priority to them. When there are a few foods ordered through a food vendor, the chef might need to prepare all of them first because they want to avoid the foods being cold and late arriving to the customers. But at the same time, they need to serve uh, the dine-in customers as well. Thus, it shows that the business currently have a sort of problem in managing their staff on how to handle the orders uh, on the both uh, dine-in customers as well as uh, orders uh, from food vendor. Secondly, we found that the business cannot manage their raw materials well. According to the owner, when the raw materials expire, then they are going to be thrown out because they want to maintain the quality of foods uh, provided are satisfied to all the customers. The business did not have any implementation of reorder level system or restock schedule to ensure that the raw materials are well stocked at the cafe. This would cause loss to the business due to their weaknesses in managing the raw materials. But the Co really need to be concerned on this issue since the, the business might incur uh, more loss in the future uh, without them noticing the cost. Secondly, we found that the business cannot manage their raw materials well. According to the owner, when the raw materials expire, then they are going to be thrown out because they want to maintain the quality of foods uh, provided are satisfied to all the customers. The business did not have any implementation of reorder level system or restock schedule to ensure that the raw materials are well stocked at the cafe. This would cause loss to the business due to their weaknesses in managing the raw materials. But the Co really need to be concerned on this issue since the, the business might incur uh, more loss in the future uh, without them noticing the cost. Lastly, we found that the business did not have uh, a roof on the outside of the cafe which could cause difficulty to the customers when there is a certain situation uh, of sudden raining. Uh, do not deny that some customers would love to sit uh, outside of the cafe since uh, it would suit them to smoke and be loud uh, with uh, their, their family and friends. But the main priority for the customers to come is to have a comfort during their meals session. Uh, besides, the customers might feel disappointed uh, in some situation when the cafe is full with uh, dining customers during rainy days uh, due to limitation of the table inside of the premises. Uh, so these are the four weaknesses that we found in the business uh, internal operation where it should be concerned by the owner so they could improve uh, in the future. Uh, thank you. So next we will proceed with the recommendation and suggestion that we have came up for the Brotherhood and Co Cafe. So for the first suggestion is that we suggest the Brotherhood and Co Cafe to create a special team to handle the catering request. So this team will be specifically tasked in producing the food for the catering. So by having this team, the Brotherhood and Co Cafe will not have difficulty in taking up the catering request for events such as wedding, birthday and special ceremony. So by taking up this catering request, the cafe can increase their sale, especially in this pandemic situation. 
So proceed with the next suggestion. The cafe can also make a rotation on their special menu. So for example, the cafe can rotate one or two of their special menu for every three months. So the, the cafe will have four rotation of their special menu throughout the year. So by doing this, the cafe can attract the customer to try the menu since it will only last for three months. And the customer who missed this three month period will have to wait for another year to try this menu. And the cafe also can also avoid the customer from being bought with having the same menu throughout the year by doing the rotation of the special menu. So next suggestion is that the Badu and Co Cafe should appoint one staff to be in charge in for the delivery service. So the cafe should appoint one staff to deal with the courier and delivery service. So the staff will be tasked with to deal with the courier and delivery service as his main task. So this person will take charge in handling the order from the booking app and handing out the food to the courier or rider. So this will avoid the courier from delivering incomplete order to customer or having any delay in delivering the food to the customer. So next is that the Badahu and Co Cafe can also try to use Google Form to receive feedback from the customer. So the cafe can put the QR code of the Google Form on every table in the cafe. So by having this QR code, the customer can give their rating, feedback and complain through the online form. So this is effective because usually the customer are very shy or scared to give feedback or complain through direct confrontation or face to face. So by using this Google form, the cafe can receive many feedback from our customer which will help the cafe to in improve their service and their food. So next is that the Brotherhood and Co Cafe can give reward to their staff. What we mean by giving reward is that the cafe can give reward to employee that meet specific requirements. So for example, uh, the cafe can give special bonus payment to employee who came early every day or employee who does not take any leave for the whole month. And for the longer serving staff, they should be given a pay rise to motivate them to stay working in the cafe. So by doing this, the, the brother and, and co cafe can reduce their employee turnover rate, decrease their employee turnover rate. So my friend Afiq will continue with the next five suggestions. Hi, I'm Afiq. I will continue the recommendation. Number 6. Recycling and composting food waste. There are two ways. The first one is compost at home. Foods that has been expired can be composed at home. This will reduce the amount of expired foods being dumped into the trash and will help to save the environment. Plus, the compost food waste can produce a valuable fertilizer for the garden. Secondly, Visit your local recycling center. The disposer do not have enough space at home to compost the foods. They can be sent to the recycling center. It is an easy method or an alternative to the compost food waste because the disposer do not have to do anything as the food that has been expired will be dealt by the recycling center themselves. Number 7 integrated management system which is POS. POS stands for point of sales. This system will give a direct connection from waiter to kitchen. When waiter take orders from the customers, he or she just punch the orders on mobile POS from the table. The list will show immediately to the staff in the kitchen. There is no need for the waiter to walk from the table to the kitchen just to give the list and this will minimize any wrong orders. It will be automatically recorded not only for the food being orders but also the customer's payments at the cashier. Number 8. Give entertainment to customers while waiting for the foods. There is possibility the cafe will delay in receiving the foods to their customers when the cafe is packed. Giving an entertainment can help to take their minds off the weight. 
as example, free access Wi-Fi to them, but make sure it is fast connections. Another example is put a larger screen for the customers to watch entertainment. Number nine, add roof for restaurant patio. This could maximize the outdoor seating position if bad weather occurred. The absence of roof will minimize the seat that can be occupied by the customers due to rainy season. This will lead to decrease in sales and loss their potential customers. Lastly, create some space for birthday events. It is nowadays trend to celebrate a birthday at the fancy cafe. Any beautiful decorations can win more customers to celebrate birthday at the cafe. That's all from us. Thank you.